Hello everyone, my name is Alad and I'm a sales engineer here at Imperva. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the steps of how to implement a custom certificate to your website you just onboarded. Before we begin, let's figure out what a custom certificate is. Whenever we onboard a website to Imperva Cloud Security Platform, we get to choose between two options. The first one is using Imperva Certificate, which allows you to use our certificate across all of your websites. It's a good option to go with since you don't have to worry about renewing or managing the certificate, you just have to bear in mind that it works only with SNI supported clients. And this is how it looks like. When I'm looking at onboarded website general certificate, I can see that it's been assigned to Encapsula, but the subject alternative name extension shows the site's URL. And you can see it over here. And this is how Imperva certificate looks like. Now the second option is of course using your own certificate, your custom certificate. So basically a custom certificate is the one that you used before you onboard your website to Imperva. Only this time we will present it to your users. Since we act as a reverse proxy between your users and their origin servers. If you don't have a certificate in place, we recommend you to get one first using the well-known registrars and certificate authority. Once you have it in place, the only thing that's left to do is to import the whole chain of it. Remember that from now on, Imperva will present the certificate to your users. Hence, we must hold the private keys. And this is how it looks like. This is your very own certificate when it's installed on your on your origin website. And this is how it looks like behind the scene. You must have the following components in place in order for the import to succeed. Certificate request, private key, and public key. Once we are sure we have everything in place, we can start the import through a few simple steps. Log on to your management console. On site settings, choose general. Under SSL support, you will find both Imperva Generated Certificate and Custom Certificate configurations. Choose Custom Certificate to configure, hit Continue, and choose option number one. Upload the file. Hit the next button and that's it. From now on you can see that the custom certificate is active and fully configured. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more how-to videos.